What were you doing? Sleeping on the job? I'm gonna tell your boss. Welcome back, everybody, to Entrouded. I'm an old guy gaming, and we're picking up pretty much right where we left off. I set a uh, uh, flame altar down here uh, where we left off in the last episode, and we, we've we already read this, right? It just, yeah, uh, wait, what? Yeah, we read that. Uh, so, I guess these guys are relootable because I had to actually stop the game and go do some stuff in real life. Uh, including editing the last video. Uh, but anyway, yeah, so <clears throat> we're going to pick up right where we left off, and we're going to keep working on these quests. Uh, right now, uh, let's see, let's look at the, the map here. We we were going after the tanning rack, and then, you know, it's one of those go here and then go here and then go there and then go here kind of things, um, which, uh, you know, which is what these little diamonds mean. So we got... We have two of the four diamonds done for the tanning station and two of five done for the blacksmith tools. Um, so why don't we do this? Let's work on the Almanac of Plants and Seedlings next, uh, which is to the south of us. And, um, you know, just see how much kind of progress we can make on that. And I think, I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, pick this altar up. It doesn't need to be here. I just put it there just so we could... Start from where we left off. Okay, so that being said, uh, let's go ahead and, and uh, it, w that was close. <laughs> I come over here and see what what this is all about. So it's a way to get up to the top of this cliff, I guess. And uh, there might be a flame altar up here. Yep, there sure is. Look at that. We'll take it. Flame Shrine, rather. And we, I believe we get three sparks. Yep, we get three sparks when we hit those from here. Okay, so that little village down there we hit last in the last episode. We need to go south for uh, for this. So let's um, set that as our waypoint. And let's do this. We'll continue to pick, you know, the the plants and stuff, the produce, as we go along. Except for the juniper thingamadoodles. I don't think we need any more of those, at least not right now. Um, oh, we need to also look at uh, our points, too. I think we have a couple of points. And I'm going to put one more... Um, point into uh, magic, and then we're gonna start switching towards over towards melee, improving our melee. Uh, so let's take a look at that. So we have two points here. What I want to do is I want healer two, uh, twenty percent more healing from spells. That's huge. So we're gonna take that because, as you guys know, I use my staff quite a bit for healing. That's really almost all I use it for. Uh, but it's very handy, you know, for that purpose, of course. And, um, yeah, okay, so moving forward now, the plan for skills is to start, you know, investing into some melee skills and getting ourselves a little bit stronger when it comes to melee. Uh, all right, so, yeah, this is just the entrance back into Raven's Keep, which we've already, we did in the last episode. This is kind of fun little dungeon crawl doing that. Grab some of those. And we need to go this way. Yeah, this way here. Okay, here we go. Got a tiger over there. Oh, look at that. We one-shot him. Nice. All right, look at us in our bad self. Southern Caravan Camp. All right. There's nothing here. Of course there isn't. You'd think Queen Jasmina would travel with style some class, yes, some luxury, some elixir, right? Nothing, just paints and pillows. Pah. At least I found an almanac of plants and seedlings in Jasmina's tent. I'll just pretend as though there wasn't any other loot if Simon asks. Hope I, hopefully I can fool him. Hope I can fool him. 
a keen-eyed that guy. Other than my private little treasures, there's barely anything for Sir Rat's rest, except the dried yucca fruit, maybe. Don't tell Matron Kendall they're mine too. Okay. Um, so now... Now, where are they going to send us to? Way down south there. Well, since we're already in the south, let's just keep going after that one, I think. Kind of makes sense to do that. Take a quick look around and see if there's any chests or anything to loot. There's a chest right there. Nice. Flask of the Fell. We'll take it. We'll take it. A little bit of a... Oh, no, I guess that was a campfire. Oh, ouch. That hurt. All right, here's another thingy here. To my beloved queen, your skin tinted olive brown, stunning and soft, your voice, a roar, a hush, always a sweet sonnet on your lips. My heart blossoms at the sight of you. I want to walk alongside you, to see your footsteps next to mine in the sand, to feel the de uh, the desert wind, to dance with you in my arms. It's all I hope for. Emily. Oh, is that like our Emily? Like our farmer Emily? I'll bet you it is. That's cool. So Emily had a thing for the queen, eh? All right. Um, we're not doing two-handed, so we're just going to salvage that. And what's this? Smoke on the horizon. A blazing fire dances atop the rooftops of Surat's Rest. We were too late. They came from Raven's Keep. Escaped. Now Surat's Rest is a pyre of madness. I tremble at the sight. What would Mother do? She'd move before the sun rose, leave all baggage behind, swift and silent, carried by the wind. A road to Longkeep is a treacherous one. We must go to Pikemead. Bless the ancients. So they're actually coming the other way back towards... Uh, you know, the Springlands, because Longkeep is is near our base. That's like the first little village that we found. <laughs> that is interesting. Okay, so I guess we're done here at this camp. Don't see anything else pertinent. I guess we can loot these guys right now, but I might end up throwing some of that stuff out later. Oh man, it can't take him anywhere. Okay, so let's see here. We'll look at uh, look at the map, and we have a really large area to try and find the almanac of the seedlings. And is this that Surat's something or other? Oh, it's a caravan raid. Wow. Okay, um, let's set that as the waypoint. <laughs> but yeah, we have quite a large area to cover here. Well, let's get to it. Let's get hopping, man. Kill that lion. I'm going to call them lions because the game doesn't tell me what the hell they're called. You know, is there like a, a bestiary? Uh, the Flame Crafts People Workshops Tutorial Lore. Not really. Uh, well, okay, hold on. Vuka and wildlife. Yeah, but this doesn't tell us about new creatures that we discover. Huh. Yeah, that's something they need to do. I mean, it's not a huge thing, but it's... It would just be... It would be a nice to have for this game if we knew what the names of all these creatures were. I would... I would like that. But I certainly would not stop playing the game if they never put it in either, though, you know? But that would be cool to have. Okay, so let's just uh, hang out on the plains here. We'll continue picking uh, produce types of items that we know we're going to need. And we've got a little something something up here. Can I hit that thing from here? Sure can. What I would really like to find is where we get the ancient bone or the fossil fossilized bones or whatever the hell those things are called because we need that stuff for farming um, and possibly other things too but farming for sure all right there's nothing up here there's a big shroud area down there another tiger way out there can we hit that guy from here yeah look at that <laughs> wow that was a long shot man that was a long shot. There's a chicken over there. Um, okay, so... He did. There's some sugar cane over here. Let's go grab it.
Uh, we don't really need any indigo. Oh, look at that, though. Oh, never mind. Yeah, sage leaves. Wait, that's not indigo. That's sage. Oh, wow. Okay. I thought that was indigo. Look at that place. The shroud seems to be a lot deeper in this area than it was in the Springlands. Like, way deep underground. Crazy, man. I'm sure we're going to have to go down there at some point. At some point, for some reason. Oh, like maybe now? Because that's right where... Oh, damn it. Damn it, Jim. Well, no, not necessarily. Not necessarily. Let's just keep going this direction. Um... Ooh, that's a new kind of mushroom guy. Is he... Is he hostile? I would say so. Are the... Is the idea here to hit them in the little... Red thingies? I don't know. They're out of stamina. That's not good. Got him. What if he drops the mint? Let's wait for that stuff to dissipate because it probably isn't healthy for us. Uh, do they drop the mint stuff? Oh, we need these. We need these. Okay, cool. Ammonia glands. Yeah, we need that to strengthen the flame and probably for other things too. Let's uh, refresh that and that. No, not that. Okay, let's grab this. Grab some peppers over here. Are there any other mushroom tree thingies in this little shroud area? Uh, doesn't look like it. Okay. Let's keep moving... Uh, this way, uh, another ginormous shroud area down there. Okay. I'm kind of hoping we can find this thing without having to go down into the shroud. Eat a sword. My goodness, look at all the peppers around here. Okay. Surratt's Rest. This has come up a few times now in the notes that we've been reading. Okay, so that narrows it down. Good. There's a bird. He went over the cliff. Yowzers. See if we can hit this guy from here. Nope, we're wasting arrows. All right, on it. We hmm, we could probably make that, but let's not let's not ch chance it. Let's not risk it for a biscuit. Okay, let me look at the map again. Ah, oh, shit, we are going to have to go down into the shroud. Eh. Okay. Got a flame thingy here. And some... Oh, fossilized bone. Nice. 
I still want to know how I can actually harvest that, though. Got him. Let's see what this bridge is all about. Okay. Oh. Yeah, let's disarm that. Do we pick it up when we do that? Here, I don't want these. Oh, no, we don't have to go down into this route. Okay, cool. I mean, not all the way down into it. Surat's Rest. Look at all that smoke, man. Kind of looks like Surat's Rest is on fire. What were you doing? Sleeping on the job? I'm going to tell your boss. Okay, I see one of those dual-wielding green bastards up there. See if we can get a sneaky sneak off on him. Also, let's um, replenish that. And let's take one of these. And one of these. Look at that. <laughs> Sneak shot, buddy. Nailed ya. Um, okay, so... Let's let's just saw a bad guy here. Is he is he no, he's ready to loot. All these dead guys on zero. I'd like to find a bed, if we can. The other thing we could do is just... Oh. Alright, well there's a repair thing. Now I definitely want to find a bed because it's not quite so important that we go back now. Things broken. Don't see a way up. Let's try this house over here. Pick some more sage. Oh, I bet this tent has a bed in it. Maybe. Yeah, we just sleep with a skeleton. We have bad guys nearby, though. It's still passing the night. Alright, so. Let's go in here. Look at this. Uh, it's just a secret entrance. Okay. Let's see what this has to say. Mind the nursery supplies, Elias. 
Please note that the crates marked nursery supplies are indeed filled with weapons for the contractor's rebel army. The guard is hot on our tail. I've buried the goods and marked the spot. Can't risk anything these days. Several of them are packed with powerful explosives, so handle with extreme care. We don't want to reveal our hiding spot. Keep quiet, yeah? We might lose our heads for this one. <clears throat> okay. Um, that probably gave us a new quest. Nursery supplies. Just a little bit... Well, down that way. And the almanac is leading us that direction. What's up here? Nothing. Alright, let's look at the map again. Nursery supplies are just right down there. Oh no, I bet you they're right up there. You don't see me, dude? Uh, I bet you they're right here where this explosive is. Oh shit! Here we go. Elder Staff! Okay, so we're currently sporting a Shepherd Staff. Level 16, 34 power. This is 37 power. Uh, yeah, so it's a little bit better. Oh, let's get rid of that. Let's salvage this. Salvage this. Rude. All right, back to this. Um... Yeah, this does seem to be a little bit better. And I don't typically upgrade these because I just use them for healing, so we'll salvage that. Let's do a sort. And da, 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 da. I think we'll keep the rest of that. Oh, we don't need this. Let's get rid of that. Okay, so back to this journal. Um, we are working on the seed thingy so it's right gonna be right probably through here scavenger loot none can fool me Thor came back from that scouting mission last night he checked this dusty bag with scrolls at me well he chucked and said it's the only thing they could scavenge I know that fool well enough to see when he's lying through his teeth. My old friend pocketed a treasure for himself, but I won't rat him out. Instead, we'll gift that almanac to the matron as a tribute. And the treasure, well, Thor will have to share. Whatever he looted from Queen Jasmina's tent will be stashed away at his favorite spot. I reckon, after all this time, he still hasn't found a better hiding place than the top of that old watchtower. Hmm, watchtower, huh? What watchtower? Where is it? Up this way, maybe? Okay. So, yeah, I guess we go that way. I thought I saw... Let's go in here for a second. More arrows. Before we get up into the town... I want to go back down here for a minute. We got a repair bench in here. Nice. With a ginormous skull on top of it. Is that a VUCA skull? I need to do that many bolts, but that's all right. There's more arrows. Bronze arrows. Oh, 
Lockpicks. Chest. When we first entered this place, yeah, I saw something going off this way. I just want to see what this is all about. Oh. It's a big mud pile. Or mud pit, rather. Uh... Bunch of mud pits. Is there anything interesting back here? Hmm. Another tiger. Another tiger. Okay, so this is just another route to get back in, I guess. Look at that. I think that's Deadly Shroud. We don't want to go down there. Sometimes it's hard to tell, though, because sometimes the red is just the reflection of the red gobbledygook. There's a wall over there. do we have here? Nothing in here. Grilled bird meat. Um, that gives three constitution. Same as this. So if you grill that meat by itself, it's not any better than the other stuff. Hmm. There doesn't appear to be anything up here. Okay, hold on. All right, why would the game have us come in here with a locked door? Oh, I see. That's why. Still, that seems like a a fair amount of acrobatics to get up here just for a normal chest, you know? <laughs> well, okay. Let's go. This place is cool, man. Oh, get out of here, rat. Ouch. Fucking rat, man. Ugh. Time to go. to redo that, redo that, redo that, redo that, and let's also take one of these, and one of these. Okay, now we're ready. Now, before we go... 
there. Take a look-see back here. Scraps. There's a climbing wall over there. Silver chest. Transcendental screen. Alright. There's another... Darn it, that's not what I wanted to do. Jump up here. There we go. Ah. More light burst. Backpack is full. Yes, it is. All right, let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of, 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 of this. Okay. Grab that orb there. Okay, I think we've explored this end pretty well. Let's look at the map again for a second. Caravan raid scavenger area. Now, it still seems to indicate that the that the almanac is there. This is a big place, man. Lots of exploration to do. Okay, we're getting to the scavenger area. Somebody just shot at me from somewhere. Come on back down. Okay, you did. You did. Oh, we got another Matron boss, okay. Let's switch to fossilized arrows for her. Can't even reach me up here. Okay, now we'll go to bronze arrows. Okay, and then back to coppers. We're getting low on arrows. I bet this matron has the the thingy on her. Yep, right there. All right, almanac of plants and seedlings of farmer. We found it. Fantastic. Fan friggin' tastic. Let's get rid of that thingy. We are like totally full up here. We'll take metal scraps. We had room for that, huh? Provisional scythe. That's great. Okay, so now we can make the really good food. So that was the thing we were missing. We have, I think we have the ingredients for just about everything else. I still would like to find out how I... get the fossilized bone stuff how I harvest it because I've just found it in loot here and there but I don't know where we go to actually harvest it my guess is we find a big dinosaur bone or something 
A note to Kendall. Sister, have my notes gotten through to you? I've missed you greatly this past year. That vile contractor tried to lock me up in a cell, a cellar in Jasper Isles, but you were correct. He couldn't keep me shackled for long. I'm sorry I've been out of touch, but I've been keeping my head down. Umber Hollow isn't any better or worse than Surat's Rest. Two sides of the same coin, like us. More bar fights, perhaps, but I can handle them. The Nomad Highlands are without order. One day, we must eclipse the chaos, sister. What do you say? Your sister, Lupa. I think Lupa's who I just killed. I think she turned into a... You know, to one of those Matron ladies that pumps the elixir right into their their heart. What's up here? Oh, this is an arena. How about that? Problem is, though, if you're back here and sitting down, you can't actually see down into the arena. Just, you know, technicality. I built a big arena in my last Conan Exiles um, playthrough a couple years ago now. And uh, yeah, that was a lot of fun. Built a huge base. I'll probably go try Conan out again at some point. I know they've made a lot of changes to it since I played last. Okay, we're done here. Um, since we're close to this caravan raid... Oh, nice. It's a new block. Let's see if we can figure out... Figure that out. Mm, I don't know if we want to go down that way, though. That's not the way we're supposed to go anyway. So Surat's Rest probably has more stuff that we can explore. Can those idiots open doors? neat place though lots of stuff here I think we were already in this area early earlier I'll take that open this door this goes out to the backyard a muddy backyard it is nice little living area Oh, hello. Nope, loot. What's up here? That's one of those ladders. Yeah, there's a thingy to loot here. Quite a few metal scraps here. Fossilized bone arrows. Too many places to go. I think we were in here earlier. Okay. Well, I don't think I've... I don't think I've completely explored this town, but I think we explored the lion's share of it anyway. Is that a scroll sitting over there? I think it is. Backpack is full. Damn it. Damn it, Jim. Um, we could probably part with one string. Shroud Meteor. More lockpicks. More hide.
Okay. Let's go back to here. Still shows the location above. Um, all right, let's... The old watchtower in Surat's rest hides valuables. Reach the top of the tower and claim the treasure there. How do we get up there? I don't see a, a grappling option. Are we supposed to parkour? Oh, there's a grappling option up there. <laughs> oh shit! I did not see that from the other side. Had I seen it from the other side, we probably would have been fine. Oh, for Pete's sake, where the hell are we at? Uh, I guess we're not too far away. Okay, let's go. We just need to find a bed somewhere. Hey, let's sleep with the skeleton again, just like we did last time. It's very comfy, sleeping on those bones. Okay, let's get onto this thing and then pull ourselves up here. And here it is. Limestone blocks. Those are nice looking. Ooh, are we going to be able to get this? Oh, yeah, we are. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I think that's going to wrap up this episode. Uh, we, uh, well, actually, you know what? Let's go back home real first before I let you go, and we'll turn this in, and then we'll wrap it up at that point. And then we'll continue going after the other stuff, of course, in the upcoming episodes. But this will open up all of the really good food for us. Okay, so let's talk to her. Almanac returned. My almanac of plants and seedlings. Wonderful. There's there's a bit of dirt on it, but it's fine. I don't mind getting my hands dirty. Let's get to planting. So you and the queen had a thing, huh? Bless the angel. How about that, eh? Okay, so we need to put this down. Uh, Let's put it right here for her. Do you remember that almanac of plants I told you? I still want it back. I just gave it to you. Okay. So now we can make chicken soup. We have to go get some more salt. We can make sugar. We can make vegetable soup. We already knew that. Mushroom omelet we don't care about so much. And we can make boiled eggs. That's a beautiful thing. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, that is. It is time for us to wrap up this episode. Uh, so we will, like I said, continue working on uh, our craftsman or NPC quests in the upcoming episodes and continue on playing this awesome game. Thanks everybody for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video and we'll catch y'all in the next episode. Bye.